Okay, so moving forward, we're gonna go ahead and look at the decal. So this is pretty much what I'm gonna use onto the Kshatriya. So from here, I'm gonna figure out where I want to place the the certain decals here onto the figure. So uh, let's try this one. So we need a hobby knife for this, and um, I want to try. And uh, this looks actually good on the side skirt. And uh, look, judging how they have too much of these, uh, most likely these will go to the binders. So uh, let me try something here. I'm gonna add something on to the um, to the side skirt. Well, not side skirt, but onto the front skirt of the figure. And uh, I'll be right back. Let me uh, cut some uh, decals on here. Okay. All right. So looking at this now, I'm gonna cut out uh, this one decal here. I'm gonna put that on the legs two sides of the legs actually and uh, I'm also gonna put let's see um, this thing uh, this on the side skirt let me cut those two out and I'll be right back so I'm actually uh, cutting the decals and I have my ghetto ghetto cutting board here literally it's a cardboard box so I'm just as you can see I'm just cutting the decal and uh, one thing I like doing about um, decal applications is I pick the ones that I, I'd like to um, stick first so I have the two decals here and I have my water here give me one second all right so uh, I actually just forgot my hobby um, hobby what do you call this tweezer whatever anyway um, I just don't like how things disappear when you need them anyway um, I had to look for them uh, I forgot that uh, when you're doing decal application you need a, a hobby knife uh, a lot of q-tips and this thing right here so basically now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put these things on water on the water there you go there you go and uh, I'm gonna pull out two of these and basically we're just gonna wait for these things to pop out or to come off come off that um, sheet where it's sticking right now Unfortunately, I don't have that lens where I can, you know, zoom in completely on this thing. That way, you guys can see what I'm looking at. Zoom in. All right. So yeah, that's pretty much what we are going to get. I'm gonna zoom in on this, and I don't think I'll be able to pull up the side skirt. Can I? One second. Oh yes, I can. There we go. So I have the side skirt here. So I'll let you. I'm gonna let um, make you guys watch how. I do the um, decal application on the side skirt and I'm also gonna do one part on the leg just to get you know just to let you guys know how easy it is to add some decals. oh there we go it, it's actually separate. that was fast okay all right so it separated and I'm gonna place it here like so and uh, normally there's a uh, there's I guess a technique on how to do this but what I do is I just get that thing come on come on come on I just be really careful with this especially when it's a special print just, ah, come on it's pretty difficult when you know like someone is watching you do this I get nervous for some reason so I'll just uh, there you go so there's the decal. I'm just gonna slide it here. So now, let me stir. Okay. So now I'm just gonna place it where I want it. I want it here. It looks cool, right here. So now it's uh, you can totally see the decal of the kshatriya onto its side skirt. 
Now you, you're gonna wipe off the excess water, water, um, by just rolling the Q-tip down, like so. See how easy that is? Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Th that's done. And um, so let's say you fi you finished all the decal applications that you wanted to add onto your onto a certain part now what you need to do next is remember how I told you guys I am using um, Microsol uh, this is to soften the decals so to do this um, mine's almost out so bear with me here all right there you go so I'm gonna wet my q-tip with the decal softener and the idea here is to make sure um, you cover the decals with the decal softener yeah just like that yeah, and, and wait for it to dry and that's pretty much it that's done uh, once you put the decal softener on there and once everything is in place with with the decals panel line and uh, the decal softener uh, all you have to do is just flat coat the thing so uh, so that's how easy it is so if you want to do it you know I suggest you guys do it and I'm gonna do one more part okay I'll do the legs and then after this um, I'm gonna work on the uh, whole figure all right so I have the Kshatriya's legs here let's zoom in on that okay so I'm gonna do the same thing uh, let me get the decal uh, where can I place it here all right so I'll just place it here that way you can see what I'm gonna do so um, zoom in okay I'm gonna remove the decal gently just be careful with this because there are some decal sheets that gets torn or gets destroyed easily and uh, with mine I'm actually thankful that it's not like that yeah shout outs to you Samuel decal all right so I'm gonna put these thing on there you see how easy that was so I'm just gonna oh um, but I'm gonna put some water on there cuz um, I need to adjust the decal Oh, there we go so it started to move so um, I'm just gonna place it there looks good there uh, I'm shaking my legs are shaking for some reason maybe I'm just nervous because I feel like someone's watching me because I'm a shy person anyway there we go so um, can we zoom in on that yes we can all right, so I'm gonna remove the excess water on there again. There you go. So there's the uh, decal on the Kshatriya's legs. And that's just how easy it is. Then I'm gonna put the decal softener, which is the one here. Just make sure it's in place. That way it will lock itself in place. It's not gonna be uh, removed it's not gonna move away from the part so that's how easy it is guys so uh, give me a few more hours it's gonna take me maybe four or five hours to complete the whole thing I'll be right back all right sorry to keep you guys waiting so there you go I actually finished uh, working on the Kshatriya now and uh, yeah I'm pretty happy about what I did here so um there you go so he's fully um she now has those fully added decals and what we're gonna do next is um add some flood coating on it all right so i'm gonna go ahead and uh flat coat the figure um, unfortunately it's already too dark um, it took me four hours to finish adding the decals on the Kshatriya so um, it's too dark to do the video outside so I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the flat coating in 
my garage. So the way to do it is, well, this is how I do things. Um, basically, you know how you put perfume on yourself? So that's gonna, that's pretty much how you're gonna do the first coat. So you're gonna put like a little bit of, um, I guess, flat coat perfume on your figure. So we're gonna do just that and uh, I'll go ahead and do this right now. Don't breathe this. Alright, so that's the first coat and all you have to do is just wait for two minutes bad that stinks okay wait for two minutes and then uh, for the second coat it uh, it's really up to you if you wanted to do a second or a third coat but uh, that's pretty much how you do a, uh, add details to your figure uh, I'm gonna go ahead and add um, a second and a third coat on this and uh, I'll, I'll show you guys the finished product on the on my next video which is gonna be a review of this guy so uh oh yeah so I forgot so if you're gonna spray flat coat on your figure we'll make sure you wear a mask because uh, back then I used to do it without any mask and I always end up getting dizzy and eh, while doing the flat coating so uh, I changed my mind <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and add a second and third coating on this I'll just move this back and I'll show you how I do the second and the third coating. So it's gonna be much more different than the first one. Alright, so there we go. Um, so yeah, like I said earlier, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the finished product and a few pictures on my next video. Thank you guys for watching.